Well, 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 what do we have here? A Volgagas 24 made out of Lego. Hello Lego fans and welcome back. This car was requested by a viewer. Bien, I've learned some Russian for this video. Thanks Boris. Get your vodka ready, track suits on and start the hard bus. Ok comrades, let's take a look. The whole thing is 5 studs wide. As you can see on the front. And a few studs long. Ok, enough with the Russian accent. The wheels are these not so new but still pretty new wheels that I got from a creator excavator, like um, micro scale excavators that you could buy. I'm not sure when that appeared but I'm pretty sure uh, you know what I'm talking about. I started building with the front of the car and the underbody. Here uh, you have the round lights exactly as on the real car. The bumper, well, that's kind of a imitation. Eh, well, as best as I could because you don't really have too many options as you can see under there just hopefully because the car is five studs wide you don't have too many options or you put two of these things and something in the middle or you just scrap the whole idea because you don't have five stud uh, long pieces I wanted to add some stickers that would represent the grill on these gray pieces but I can't really do stickers I'm sorry but I kind of suck at and I don't really know how to print it or on what material I never really looked into stickers on the hood you have the true adidas straps as every Slav car should have well, kind of inverted but you get the idea as every true Slav knows adidas is quality shit and the most comfortable outfit for squatting the interior of the car is pretty simple it only features a steering wheel and a place for somebody to sit that's because I couldn't really fit anything else just because how the roof is done you see you can't really fit uh, a chair and in that a minifigure because it would uh, knock his head in the roof and the interior is actually dropped down by uh, two plates so you can fit a minifigure I will try to put in a minifigure at the end of the video oh yes and it has this cool function this wasn't actually intended just how it came up the rear of the car features a bumper exhaust and some lights and a towing hook imitation that would be the towing hook imitation and there under you can see the exhaust unfortunately i couldn't add a binocular because how the underside is done and i couldn't attach it to anything Oh yes, and the rear of the cab has this interesting shape over there and you can see how the back window is done. I did it this way, so you have that uh, typical Volga shape and if you look at the real thing, you will observe some um, grills would like to represent those shapes. And of course for the windscreen I only have these two levers, because LEGO doesn't make uh, five white windscreens, so I had to improvise. And in the end, the most important thing, can it fit a minifig? Here I have Mechanic Ivan, or Ivan. Let's see if he can drive this thing. Well, damn it, Ivan can't fit the vehicle. Let's remove his hair, make him bold. Hopefully that will help. Oh yes, now he fits. And his smart head holds the whole roof. And you can add his toolbox on the towing hook and his wrench as an antenna. Every true slab knows if you don't have antenna, you can use a wrench. Thank you for watching and for if you're out. Babushka, where is the shashik?